Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm doing a review on the Power Hands Power Fit Weighted Training Gloves. So check it out. Hey guys, Carlo here, and today I'm doing a review on the Power Hands Power Fit Weighted Training Gloves. These retail for $44.99 on the Power Hands website. It comes in this gold and black colorway. I got mine in large. You can get these anywhere between small and triple XL, just depending on your hand size. And there is a sizing chart on their website that you can use for reference. Now, this is my second pair of Power Hands gloves I'm doing a review on. I did a review on their Striking Gloves about, I wanna say two years ago, was really impressed by those. And what originally got me um, interested in these gloves was I saw a couple of boxers using them when they were shadow boxing, most notably Andre Ward, which I think he's also a, a spokesperson for their brand and, and Marcus their gloves. But that's what originally got my interest in these um, was the fact that it's an open palm design uh, and the weight is on the back of your hand. So compared to like egg weights or using a dumbbell for your shadow boxing, which is perfectly fine, I do like the benefit and the fact that your palm is completely open. Now there's a couple of key differences between those striker gloves uh, and these weighted training gloves. The first thing that's probably the most obvious is that these are going to be open fingered where the striker gloves are completely closed off. Um, and the striker gloves are also more expensive. So the striker gloves I believe are at $59. So basically $60 where these are at $45. So you're basically paying $15 more uh, for the striker gloves. The other thing that was interesting was that these were actually heavier than the striker gloves when I put them on the scale. So when I put these gloves on the scale, I want to say the left glove was at like 15.3 ounces and the right glove was at 14 ounces. So they're about a pound off from each other, uh, but one pound is 16 ounces. So uh, for, this, for the sake of rounding up, each glove is a hair under a pound each. Uh, when I weighed the striker gloves, those gloves came in at a, like 11 ounces. So they're actually lighter than these and I prefer uh, a little bit more weight. I mean, that's if I'm gonna, if I'm gonna pay less and get more weight, to me that's a better deal because these gloves are $15 cheaper than the striker gloves. Um, unless you really want to go with that closed finger design. The other big difference between the striker gloves and these is the striker, striker gloves have a leather palm where these actually have a rubberized textured grip palm. So, you know, to me, these are good gloves for shadow boxing and, and, and doing all kinds of different workouts, but they're more geared for also weightlifting. So if you're in the gym and you're doing weightlifting and you just want to give yourself a little bit of extra weight on your hands while you're training rather than using standard weightlifting gloves, and then these would be a really good choice uh, compared to other weightlifting gloves that don't have weights on the back of the hand. Um, so that is very nice as well. I personally prefer these over the striker gloves because I do like having my fingers exposed. I feel like I get a little bit more autonomy over what I can grab and a little bit more of a better feel. When I'm wearing gloves that are completely covered, if I'm trying to pick something up with my fingers, it just feels a little bit, you know, you don't feel like you get that same type of touch and detail when you're grabbing something. Um, and I do like that open finger design where you do uh, have the ability to grab things and really feel it with your fingers. I also do like the fact that you get that rubberized grip on the palm side compared to the leather side. Um, and that's gonna help with if you're doing any type of cross training. So say you're, you're shadow boxing and then you have to go pick up dumbbells or some kettlebells and you're doing bicep curls or, or shoulder presses or whatever, 
to me, this is a little bit more durable in terms of being able to grab and not get worn out like leather. And it gives you a little bit of grip as well. So when you're picking something up, it doesn't slide out of your hands. So I definitely like that. Um, and then the added weight. I mean, these are about three to four ounces heavier than the striker gloves, uh, which was kind of surprising to me because the striker gloves actually give you a little bit more weight on the top part of your fingers right here. So I, just visually speaking, I thought the striker gloves would be heavier and that wasn't the case. These were actually heavier. So uh, these gloves are, are made in Pakistan. There's actually a breakdown in the material that's uh, used to make this glove. They're made in Pakistan. It says Power Hands, Power Fit Weighted Training Gloves. I got mine in large. They fit me perfectly. Um, it's made of 35% nylon spandex, 30% leather, 25% uh, synthetic leather, 5% foam gel, and 5% lycra. The inside liner is kind of like a, um, I don't know, like the spandex, almost like a wetsuit type material. It's very comfortable. Um, does a pretty good job of wicking away the moisture. It doesn't soak up very bad uh, if you're sweating a lot. You also do have the Power Hands one inch Velcro strap that's rubberized on the back, and it does say Power Hands right there that's uh, recessed into the leather strap. So I do like that. Uh, again, you have that rubberized grip on the palm side with the stitching. You know, the quality on these are pretty, pretty good. They've held up real, real nicely. You can see it does have that exposed and open finger design. And then the back of the glove, that's where all the magic is at. That's where all the weight is. And like the other glove, I don't know if it's sand or some type of silica, some type of uh, grain material on the inside. And that's what gives the weight to each glove. And you can see right here that it's on the thumb and then as well as on the back of the palm and on the fingers. I do like the fact that they segment the weights, meaning that it's not all one big piece. Um, and what that does is it gives you flexibility. So when you make a fist, you can see that my hand kind of spreads the weight out. If this is all one piece, it would feel a lot more stiffer and rigid and wouldn't give you the ability to really uh, make a nice tight fist and it would probably feel uncomfortable. So the placement of the weights is in a perfect spot right on the back of your hand um, and is distributed nicely throughout the entire hand. You can see it's on the thumb, it's on the back of my palm and it's over each uh, of my knuckles on my finger. So it doesn't feel like all the weights on the back part right here or too far forward on the front. Um, and so you, you definitely feel like it's a very well balanced glove uh, to use when you're shadow boxing. Obviously the big benefit aside from the open palm design is the fact that now you can grab things. So if you wanted to grab some weights and hold on to them and give yourself a little bit more uh, of a challenge or conditioning, you can do so. Um, but so far, I love these things. Um, I throw them in my gym bag and I use them during my shadow boxing just because they're convenient to use. Um, and it has a good amount of weight, almost one pound per hand. So that definitely helps with your hand speed. Um, and when you take them off after you're done shadow boxing, you'll definitely notice, and that might be a little bit also of, of kind of getting that placebo effect where you feel like your hands are faster because you've removed the gloves and the weight. In that case it is, and you can build up to that. The only drawback I'd say with these gloves is removing them. I wish they would have put some type of like fin or something on the fingertips so it's easy to remove these gloves. Um, when you're sweating and you're pulling these off, it tends to want to stick onto your hand and it's really hard to kind of like pull the glove off, trying to slide it off your palm. So it would have been nice that they added some type of like little fin or something. I've seen gloves that have that where it's like a little grab piece right here where you can actually grab it and then pull the fingers right off. Uh, especially when you're sweating, it's, it's a lot harder to do. Um, and you can just slide them off your hands and not, uh, you know, have that inconvenience of them sticking to your hands. But so outside of that, really satisfied with these gloves, you know, for the price point of $44.99, they've held up well. I think definitely think they've, they're a great asset to your boxing training. Um, and they're pretty versatile. I mean, you don't have to use them just for boxing, you use them for your weight training, strength conditioning, and they definitely come in handy. Even if you're going out for your road work and you're running and you just wanna have these on your hands while you're running, you can do that as well. And they're very convenient to use. So if you guys have any questions or comments, make sure you guys leave them down below in the comments box. I'll put the link in the description box where you can find these Power Hands Power Fit weighted training gloves. I'll see you guys later. Take care.